reactive bullshit is when the world brings you something, whether it's a person saying something, whether it's a situation, whether it's even you who does something that triggers you, that elicits an emotional response from you, okay? Reactive bullshit is when instead of being aware of your emotional state, checking in with yourself and creating a conscious response to the situation, to the person or to yourself, you just react in some habitual way. There are three essential concepts that will help you to master your reactive bullshit. The first and fundamental concept is that we are all dreaming our own dream. You have to get a hold of this fact that even though we have this thing that we sort of loosely call shared reality, everybody has their own perspective and everybody is dreaming their own dream. And everybody is responsible for managing their own dream, not anyone else's. Now, the second fundamental concept, perspective, that you need to be able to hold in order to master your reactive bullshit is that everybody's always doing their best and everybody has the same basic needs. We have to understand that every human being that's ever lived has been hardwired with the same needs. Okay, we can talk about cultural differences and relativity all you want, but essentially we all have the same needs. And by needs, I mean things like shelter, nourishment, oxygen, water, okay? These are basic fundamental survival needs that we can't live very long without, okay? But we also have other needs as human beings like connection, like community, belonging, self-expression, creativity, beauty. Imagine a life that was chronically without any of these things and you'll be imagining a dramatically impoverished life for any human being. So everybody's got the same basic needs. Where we differ is that we have very different strategies for meeting those needs, okay? I like to use the example of pizza, okay? You do not need pizza. I don't care how much you like pizza. I don't give a fuck how often you eat pizza. You do not need pizza. You need nourishment and you need comfort and you need familiarity. These things are human needs. Pizza is a strategy to get those needs met. You have to be able to distinguish between needs and strategies. This is fundamental. All right? Because our feelings, that's right, feelings arise out of our needs. Our feelings are not reactions to the world. The world doesn't put feelings in us. The world doesn't make us feel a certain way, ever. That's some bullshit. You made me feel. It's bullshit. The world doesn't, other people don't make us feel a certain way. We feel a certain way when our needs are met or unmet, when our expectations are met or unmet. That's when our feelings arise. The skill that you have to develop in order to master your reactive bullshit is the skill of listening. When we listen to other people with curiosity, when we recognize that they're a whole human being with needs, and feelings of their own, connected to their own dream, then we can get curious about them and wonder what's up with them. When we get curious about people, we automatically begin to connect with them. And it's impossible to be curious about somebody and reacting to them at the same time. So remember that. You cannot simultaneously give empathy to somebody. The skill is listening, it's empathy, it's connecting with their feelings and needs while making them wrong. Finally, I just want to say this about reactive bullshit. We're reacting when we're not responding from a place of intention and integrity. When you're setting intentions and you're living according to your intention, then you're living with power. Because when you're reacting to other people, you're letting other people basically dictate your state. 
You're letting them own your ass. When you are setting intentions about how you're showing up in the world, and you carry that intention through your day, regardless of how other people are reacting, you don't meet them at their level, you get curious about them from your level, from where you're at, from where your integrity and your values lie. That's real power. And that's the way to cut through your reactive bullshit to be able to fully connect with people and walk in your power. Wow.